Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Claudia. Today I'm super excited because I am doing a review on the Golden Goose sneakers. This is my first pair so I have never owned a pair before so I'm so excited to show you this pair. Um, I will say <clears throat> that I have opened them already because I had to uh, figure out my sizing to make sure that they were going to fit before I actually use them for this video. But some of the things that I want to mention about Golden Goose that I learned, I actually purchased these right on the website, right through the website, goldengoose.com. And they have a super excellent return policy. So if you don't know what your size is and you're in between sizes like I am, I'm typically a 36.5 and I actually ordered a 36 and a 37 because I wasn't really sure. I did watch several reviews where some people said size go a half size lower if you're in, in, in the middle or go a half size up. And you know what? The, the reviews are all torn and all of our feet, I mean, our feet are all different. So I mean, I don't necessarily go off of that. I try to just do my own homework and sometimes I order two pairs if I have to and then return the one that doesn't fit. But what I did is I ordered both and to my surprise, um, the 37 was the one that fit me. The 36 was too tight, so it was not comfortable at all. Um, and I do want to just jump right in and start showing you everything, but I wanted to at least give you some of that information. They have great customer service. If you order two pairs, they do send you a po paid postage and all you have to do is call DHL and they will come and pick up the item. You call them, set up an appointment, they come pick it up. It's super easy. Actually, it was a lot easier than me going to the store and trying to return them. So just wanted to put that out there. If you're thinking about buying them and you're worried about, if you live in the U S and you're worried about buying these shoes and these shoes having to travel internationally, at least you'll know that you can do that. That's a good option. So I'll go ahead and jump in. So when you buy the shoes, they do come with your receipt. So there's a receipt, but I'll keep that private. And I think that's cute. If there's any problem, don't worry. We'll take care of you is what comes right on the receipt. And I will say they took very good care of me. So totally agree with that. Um, so I'll go ahead and open. So it does come with a bag. So like a sneaker bag, you know, storage bag, super cute. Now I'll open so I can show you the actual sneakers. These are the sneakers. So I'm going to try to do a close up. So these are the women's superstar sneaker with gold sparkle foxing and metal stud lettering. So these are the, it's a handmade shoe. Um, you know, I'll put up a link as well on my, you know, on my description. So if you're looking for this exact pair, I can give you a link. And you know what, one of the reasons why I went with the superstar sneaker was, you know, from all the reviews that I watched, everyone tends to say that the superstar sneaker is a really good walking sneaker. And I really wanted a walking sneaker. You know, my husband and I are planning a trip to Italy in October and I wanted a shoe that was casual, but maybe I can wear with a dress or a skirt and still look trendy. And the big thing was I wanted a shoe that I didn't have to baby. You know, I have Balenciagas, I have Gucci and Tory Burch and Jimmy Choo and you name it. I have these shoes and I find myself always having to baby them. I'm constantly cleaning them. I'm constantly wiping them. I'm afraid all the time that I'm, I'm going to scuff it and damage the shoe. And for once I said, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and cave in and buy these shoes. I know there's a lot of talk sometimes about why would you want to buy a pair of shoes that look dirty? But in my opinion, if they're trendy and they're, they already kind of have marks on them, that makes me feel better so that if I do scuff them, I don't really care, right? I mean, that's how I see it. And I ended up going with this specific style because I wanted something that was fairly white, but I wanted something that, do, that didn't look super excessively dirty. And I don't think these have that look. I mean, you can see the scuff mark here, like the little discoloration here on the side of the shoe. There's a little bit you can see here, right? You can see obviously on the bottom here, you can see those marks. And on this side, you can see the same, like there's some stuff there, but it doesn't look excessive. I mean, the shoelaces, I'll get as close as I can. You can see some of the, some of the marks there, but you know what? I love the concept of these shoes that they're just rugged and dirty looking and who cares? And they're still trendy. So I'm super excited to, to wear these shoes. Um, I did try them on around the house just to see if they were comfortable. And so far they feel really comfortable, but of course only time will tell. I hear once you break them in, they're supposed to be good to go. But in my opinion, I think they're super cute. They're a really, really cute pair and I'm so excited to wear them. I will tell you when you look at both of the shoes here, the right shoe, you can actually see the Golden Goose logo thing here. And the other shoe doesn't have that. So just as an FYI, I mean, aside from that, I mean, the shoe looks pretty, 
similar. You've got the, the golden goose back there. You have the star on both sides. But the only difference is your right shoe will have that logo there. Yeah, so I'd love to hear your thoughts on these sneakers. Do you own any pairs? And is there a specific style that you enjoy wearing over another pair? Again, this is my first pair, so I don't know. I'm not an expert with, when it comes to Golden Goose, but I am super excited to wear these and I am going to wear them as much as I can so I can break them in and also be able to come back and give you a follow-up review. But I would love to hear from someone who actually owns these shoes. It doesn't have to be the same color, but if you, if you own a, a Superstar or another sneaker, I would love to hear if there's another sneaker that might be more comfortable or, you know, just some feedback there. So if you're willing, I'd love to hear from you guys. I'm going to go ahead and just try them on for you so you can see what they look like on and then we will be done. Okay, so I do just want to show you quickly what they look like. And I think they're really cute. I mean, I think they look cute with jeans and obviously, I mean, shorts. I even think a cute little casual dress would be really cute. I think they're super cute. Would love to hear what you guys think. Super cute. And I will tell you, they're very comfortable. Again, you know, I've worn these around, the, around my house and they're so comfortable. I have no issues with them at all. Okay, well, as usual, thank you so much for visiting my channel and I hope to see you again.